Even though we all dream of having a giant bedroom we could decorate to our heart's desire, most of us are stuck with much smaller ones. But this doesn't mean you can't decorate your room. There are tons of things you can do in a small space too. In this video, we'll give you 18 ideas that you can use to make your small bedroom a space you'll absolutely fall in love with. 1. Most small bedrooms don't come with one of the most important features of a bedroom, a proper place to put all of your clothes. To remedy this, most people just add a rack smack in the middle of the room, which only makes the space look even smaller. A storage compartment like this, with a pair of light, airy curtains in front of it, gives you all the space you need for your clothes and accessories. Adding two little hooks to hang your laundry baskets from will make sure that everything is in place and nearby if you need it, without making your room look like a big ball of clutter. 2. If your bedroom is a nook-style room, you might not have a lot of floor space to work with. You can hook up hanging lights like this accordion-style lamp that can easily be adjusted according to the type of lighting you need. If you're renting and don't want to nail in a shelving unit to hold your little knickknacks, you can even get shelving like this that just stands between your bed and the wall, giving you space for days. 3. Most bedrooms don't have a lot of storage space to dedicate to a standing shelf, but that doesn't mean you can't have any shelving. Floating shelves like these are perfect if you don't have enough floor space, but have plenty of empty space near the ceiling. Add a few of them to store your books or hang them near your mirror to keep all your makeup exactly where you need it, without having to sacrifice any floor space at all. 4. Small rooms usually result in the classic boring look of white walls one white lamp, and white bedding on a headboardless bed. But it's actually super easy to add dimension to your room, even without adding things. Just switch out some of the boring white things and replace them with colored versions of the same thing. Take these blue blinds, for example. Pair it with little blue additions throughout the room. They add dimension and interest. The pop of blue makes everything look a lot fresher without you even having to try very hard. Five. Although it may be tempting to try and create visual separation in the room by painting the walls different colors, that might just make the room look smaller than it is. Instead, go for one solid color. This creates a sense of seamlessness in the space. A unique color like this also acts as a distraction. When the eye is drawn to the walls, you don't notice the size of the room as much. 6. When you have a small bedroom, but need to house multiple people in it, it can be pretty hard to allocate space for each person. Instead of buying two regular beds, get a bunk bed instead. This way, you'll have sleeping space for two while only taking up the floor space of a single bed. You then also have extra floor space that can be used by each person as their own space in the room. 7. Many people choose to have small beds in small bedrooms in order to not waste space with a big piece of furniture. It might actually be a better idea to go the opposite route instead. Get a big statement bed and let it take over your room. You can always offset the largeness of the bed by adding smaller furniture pieces in the rest of the room. 8. Although having a pattern on all four walls of your room might make it feel smaller, it doesn't mean you have to keep every aspect of your room plain. One single feature wall with a pattern can draw the eye to it and make the rest of the room look freer, adding visual space that isn't actually there. 9. Another great way of adding storage space in a small bedroom is to go for furniture that's literally attached to your walls. Something like this over the bed takes up about the same amount of space that would generally be taken up by your side tables, but it provides you with more storage space than a regular small closet would. 10. No matter what your style is, there's one thing that everyone can agree on. Nothing beats natural light. If your room is small or oddly shaped like this one, you can open up the space by adding a giant window that will let in natural light and make the outside world seem like it's part of the room too. 11. Wall paint that's too dark or shockingly bright can shrink a room a lot. You'll want to use light pastel shades of the color you like in order to bring in color without it being too distracting. Light airy colors like this pastel gray can make the room look a lot bigger than it actually is. 
Better yet, going for a half splatter wall like the one shown here gives you the opportunity to direct the eye upward, also adding to the visual space. 12. A storage bed is somewhat of an all-in-one piece of furniture. You can sleep on it, lounge on it, and use it to keep all of your things. If you can find one with multiple drawers, you can easily compartmentalize your belongings and won't even need to have side tables. Storage beds are easily the one piece of furniture that looks straightforward, but secretly serves almost every purpose imaginable. 13. Just like dark walls, dark rugs and carpets make rooms look small too. Switching a dark carpet out for a pastel or beige one will let more light bounce around in your room, making it seem bigger. It's even better if you can get a pastel carpet that goes from corner to corner like the one shown here. Add a small chair on one side and there will seem to be tons more space than there actually is. 14. In the past few years, lofts have really made their mark. They're perfect for doubling up the space you have in your room by splitting things into two floors. Even if you don't have the resources to redo your whole room into a loft, you can easily create the same effect by getting a loft-style bed. You can fit a small couch or an entire study or work desk under the lofted bed, meaning you get two main pieces of furniture in one space. 15. If all you have to work with in your bedroom is the wall your bed is against, consider bumping the bed up a few inches and adding built-in storage underneath it. This is a great example of how to do this without taking over the entire room. You can easily use this to store books and other things that you might not have space for anywhere else. Even if you don't need this space for storage, you could use it as a display wall to fill up with small decorative pieces. 16. If you truly only have space for a bed in your room, maximize the use you get out of it. Opting for a multi-purpose bed frame like this could be perfect. These give you shelving, under-the-bed storage, and the design elements your room might be lacking because of the small space, all in one. 17. When you don't have much space in your bedroom, adding lots of mirrors all around helps create the illusion of space. This is especially great if you don't have a large window in your room. Just place them strategically and they'll bounce the light around in your room, making up for the lack of windows and opening up the space. 18. Nothing eats up visual space like clutter. Tidy everything up so the room looks more open. Make sure you don't have any random piles of clutter on your bed or desk. And yes, this also includes the laundry chair. This will work even better if you get lighter colored furniture because everything will reflect the light and keep the feel of the room light, working together to make the room seem bigger overall. That's a wrap for this video. Which one of these will you be using to rearrange your bedroom? Let us know in the comments. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one!